Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Louis, and God bless every single one of you. Today is April 13, 2024, and welcome to the Grand Penis channel. All right, guys, so we have some urgent information coming out. If you can, please share this video. And it says here, Persia Ballistic hit the Holy Land. Air defense failed. New strikes targeting Holy Land bases in those regions. Now Persia came out and said the strike is complete. We're not going to fire no more. That's what Persia said. They say, that's it. We're not going to fire no more. We already launched 500. But Holy Land, I think Holy Land, Benjamin, he's saying, uh-uh. Now it's my turn. So again, we're going to see what's going on here, guys. I've been posting videos left and right you wouldn't believe it <laughs> so uh many of you didn't receive no notifications one two three four four videos on this channel five six seven and this one will make eight altogether eight videos about the missile strikes so I've been on to date. Uh, we already talked about this hours ago. The sad part is that most of these videos were put under the rug. Many of you didn't receive the notification. And this happens all the time when there's big breaking news like this. So it's very important to please share the video. And this is why I say that your support truly helps out. Because the platform is not what it used to be. And... Again, like I said, we do this as full time. And I want to thank everybody so much again, either through PayPal or Patreon or the Super Thanks. Thank you so much. Your support truly helps out. And uh, yeah, we're going to see what's going on here, guys. Hopefully, you guys get the notification for this one. Um, all right, let's see what's going on here. Once again, Persia launched a major strike targeting an air base in the Jeff Desert, as well as the Holy Land forces in the Strip and the Heights. Wow. Now, it took eight, uh, yeah, it took like five hours or six hours. So they, uh, they launched the, um, the drones, the Kamikaze drones. They were the first one. And according to experts, it takes eight hours to reach the Holy Land. From Persia to the Holy Land, it takes eight, uh, eight hours. Uh, but it seems like it only took four hours or five hours. It wasn't that long. The cruise missiles and ballistic ones, it took two hours. All right. From Persia. Now, Persia proxies, like uh, those other lands, they fired their stuff and it, uh, it reached the Holy Land really quick because they're much closer to the Holy Land. So, again, there were at least four or five lands fired towards the Holy Land. All right, so once again, Persia has fire, a whole bunch of them. There are reports of explosion in those regions. The Holy Land anti-aircraft defense failed to intercept them all. Wow! Are you serious? Guys, the reason why this happened is because the Holy Land radar was hit by cyber. So someone hit the Holy Land radar. And so just imagine you see these things coming towards you in the radar and then all of a sudden, poof, they're gone. <sighs> someone hit the Holy Land radar. It says here a major ballistic strike is on the way. A fact that shows that no one expected such a large reaction from Persia. It appears there have been several impacts on the Holy Land during the Persian strikes. These videos, I'm not going to play, but just follow me on Twitter. I'm sharing these links on Twitter. Uh, you'll be able to see the videos and stuff like that. Again, I can't play it, guys, because I'm getting hit on this platform. And also copyrights. Once again, you have the Holy Land military have confirmed that Persia has launched ballistic towards the Holy Land. Mm. The Holy Land is under significant strike from Persia Ballistic. Mm. 
according to According to NYT sources, the Holy Land of, uh, Intelligence maintains that the primary target of the first wave of the strike is is the Najiv Air Base. Once again, the nuclear facility in this region are also nearby. The ballistic were launched from Persia Guard bases. Once again, in those regions and the capital. The Holy Land, Iron Dome, and Patriot Anti-System are trying to take them down. <sighs> Yikes. At the same time, the Holy Land Intelligence Services detected the launch of dozens of drones and crews from Persia and Iraq, according to two Holy Land officials. Now, the cruise missile reportedly flew over in northern Iraq city of Erbil en route to the Holy Land. So once again, it was not only Persia, but other lands fired. The question here is what next? But once again, guys, I will bring you all the information, all the updates. Again, notifications will not be sent out. So it says here, interception by the Holy Land Iron Dome system seen earlier over Mount... Hebron in Southern, I'm going to skip that name there. If you guys want to check out the video, the link to this article will be in on my Twitter page. Once again, it says here. It says here you have a uh, footage showing the sky above Jerusalem interception. Ongoing against Persia ballistic. Once again, you have this group struck over the Holy Land. Whew. Look at that. Wow. That's all the stuff, the territory, Persia. And other proxies came. The night sky was filled with drones and ballistic stuff. Ballistic crews, drones launched by the Persian Aerospace Force from Persia at the Holy Land have reached the land's airspace. Iron Dome and Patriot uh, system of the Holy Land uh, military are trying to take them down. There's a lot of videos here, guys. Persia says the attack is over. That's it. Persia is like, all right, that's it. That's it. And the question is, will the Holy Land respond? Benjamin said they will. Persia says the event is over. Immediately after the latest wave of ballistic was fired, Persia issued a statement. Persia delegation to the UN invokes the right to self-defense to justify Persia strike on the Holy Land while warning the sleeping giant not to get involved in this conference, uh, confrontation. Under Article 51 of the UN Charter, Persia military action was in response to again the holy land group struck on our diplomatic facility in damask the persian delegation to the u.n said in a post on platform x arguing that the issue can now be considered over he warns however if the holy land makes another mistake persia respond will be much more severe. Wow. This is a confrontation between Persia and the uh, again, I'm going to skip that name, of the Holy Land that the sleeping giant must stay away from. Wow. Strong message from Persia.
Once again, perves of military aerospace forces just launched multiple ballistic. These videos are showing their launch from multiple regions. I'm sorry, guys. I wish I could play the video. I I, I wish I could play the video. But again, for some reason, I'm I'm always getting hit. CCTV footage from Persia Capital a couple of minutes ago. Man, they got hit really hard. So, my next video, we, again, we're still going to talk about this here, guys. We're still going to talk about it. Um, so, there's a lot of updates. Again, notifications will not be sent out. If you guys want to check out more of these video updates, I will be posting them on this channel and also at the real GS News. I've been busy all day. And uh, again, videos links will be in the comments box if you guys missed it. So I've been putting out left and right videos nonstop. A lot of research, a lot of uploading, editing is uh, time consuming. So again, this is uh, this is what I love doing, being a watchman and give you guys uh, the uh, world events, nation against nation, that is related to Bible prophecy. The Gospel of Luke, Mark, Matthew, John. We are seeing great Bible prophecy events. I believe, even though Persia says it's over, uh, the Holy Land is saying, no, you will be the next strip. Um, so basically, uh, you will be the next G-A-Z-A -A strip. You just... Uh, push the button on us. So buckle up. I think this thing, uh, this is gonna hit the fan. Persia is saying it's over, but uh, you can't do that, Persia. If you hit the Holy Land, you gotta go all in, man. <laughs> you gotta go all in because the Holy Land is not gonna uh, just sit back and say, "Oh, okay, you guys don't know how to finish the job." So again, uh, I would keep it updated on this one here. Um, Multiple facilities was hit, air defense was not working. And the reason why, like I said, uh, is because of cyber. And I did post a video of it, cyber hit radar. So again, guys, uh, please share the video. Check out the videos I posted today. The links will be in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching. Once again, for those of you that want to give a like to Christ, you can email me. My email is in the description box. Me and my wife are here to help many and to lead many to the righteous path. And that's the path of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. For those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago, or my wife, Jessica Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. Once again, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get your access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about on the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those links will be in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Put your faith and trust in Jesus Christ, for he's the only way, the truth, and the life. No one gets to the Father but through Jesus. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time later. Peace.